always thought that if you believed in them, your dreams would come true. Guess I was wrong. Goodbye, Academy. And it's all Bianca's fault. I don't know how you can stay so calm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, no, I don't want you to go. I'm gonna miss you so much, Aunt Betsy. It's unbelievable that they're refusing to accept you. Aren't you angry? Me? Angry? No. 123, 124. Stay 100. strong, Maggie. You'll find another way to make your dreams come true. If I were you, I'd definitely change my ways. Just a friendly piece of advice. 151, no. 152, 153, 154. I warned you, Weirdie. You just don't fit in here. 161, 162, 160. Oh, Maggie, I've been looking for you. Oh, and you too, Bianca. I was actually looking for both of you. Yes, yes, why? Oh, yes, I have some news. Actually, two different pieces of news. Okay, just tell us. Yeah, okay, well, the first bit of news is that, uh, Maggie, You've been accepted. What? <laughs> and the second piece of news is that you two will be roommates. No. No. There must be some kind of mistake. That's impossible. Oh, no. On the contrary. I have a letter here from Mr. Lucy. Your father? Yes, yes. And it says, I made a mistake in trying to please my daughter. It is really unfair not to accept this talented <gasps> American girl. <laughs> it is my opinion that Bianca should learn to live side by side with someone from to my face. <clears throat> well, welcome to the Fashion Academy of Milan. <laughs> so I was right. Dreams really can come true if you believe in them. Bravo. Well done. But you're still really weird. <laughs> Today is a very special day. There will be no classes. Instead, you will use the time to explore and get a taste of the campus. <laughs> so we can eat it? <clears throat> it's a tradition here at the Academy. Today is our orientation day. The regulations say that one day shall be used for students to find their way around the campus and the working tools available. It'll take a whole day? Do you know what trend boards, mood boards, or color swatches are? Mm -hmm. My point exactly. This is an international school, so we have students here from many different countries and cultures. For example, we have a student from... Milan! <laughs> One from Paris. And no. from the magical Harajuku. <laughs> and he's Greek. That's incredible, mm -hmm. huh? I'm from Como. Isn't that amazing? Okay, okay. Now it's time for the big orientation day competition. You'll be split into two teams, one dorm versus the other. It'll be boys <laughs> against girls. The goal of this competition is for you to learn, uh, uh, uh what do we want them to learn? Collaboration. We want them to collaborate, no? All right then. Go out there, have fun, and may the best dormitory win. <laughs> <laughs> Don't they high five in Italy? We're gonna win. We're so much better than the girls. Let's call ourselves the bad boys, just like my favorite team. This is lame, it's a joke. It's not a joke. It's a real competition and we have to win. Huh? And you're gonna be the one to lead us to this victory? Okay, guys, let's hold back all this aggression and turn it into something positive. I'm trying, but it's so hard. Can you smell that? I sure do, it's my new hydrating deodorant. It's called cactus. It's the smell of victory! Victory is ours! Yeah. Pathetic. <sighs> I love my room. So clean and fresh. It's perfect, just like me. Except for that horrible-looking thing. It belongs over in the corner with her other tacky-looking junk. <sighs> Oh, don't mind me. I need a lot of space. That's your area, all right? Yes, but how am I supposed to- I told you you don't belong here. Ah, uh, no, that's mine. And that one. That one too. So they're all yours? Exactly. Listen, it's not because I'm mad at you. It's just I've never had to live with someone before. Weren't you living with your father? That's just it. Ever since my mom died, we don't talk much anymore. I understand. 
and I'm sorry. You can't understand. Your mom writes to you all the time. Yeah, she loves talking to me. And she sings. She even taught me how to play guitar. <laughs> Gozy, a happy family living on the prairie. You, mommy, daddy, and the billy goats. You're wrong, but I do have a billy goat. Just not a father. Uh, he left when I was born. He was Italian, you know. He used to sing with my mom. <laughs> a musical family. What's wrong? You don't like music? My father says it's for losers. And I kind of agree with him. Ugh. Wait, what are you doing? I'm getting rid of all the ugly stuff. Ugh. Ugh. We don't have to like the same styles, you know. Yes, but boho chic is not stylish. No. Ugh. Okay, face it, you don't belong. I cannot give in. One, two, three. Why can't I just chill out? There she is, my favorite stylist barista. Well, Max, if this keeps up, you'll be killing your favorite stylist barista. Uh, well, just make yourself at home here. This mess is like being at home. Well, feel free to tidy up here and um, all of it. Yeah, all of it. See ya. 13, 14, 15. At least I'm not with me. The Milky Way is a terrible place to have our welcome toast. Well, I love this place. I think it's got great taste. What are you saying? Did you taste it? Yuki. Yeah, you calling me? Shut up. I think you and me could be good friends. Yeah, we could. But we won't. <laughs> service here today? <laughs> hey, how's everything going? The first game is intended to prove your knowledge on specific materials. Each competitor will have to figure out what the material is without actually seeing it. Therefore, you'll need excellent knowledge and precise answers. You're going down. We're supposed to be on the same team, you know. Don't remind me. I'm trying to forget it. You will only get one guess. Then you're out. Kaput! Finished. A goner! All right, let's have the first two competitors. Okay, who's gonna, uh, I don't know what to do. What do you want to do? Mm -hmm. what, what, mm -hmm. oh. Okay, we gotta figure it out. What do you think? No, no, yes, you do it. Have to come on. Don't worry, girls. I'm the Shanghai champion. Are you sure about this guy? He may be Jack, but he's real delicate. He's allergic <laughs> to all synthetic materials, so he'll know what it is right away. Or maybe he'll break out knives and pass out. Trust me on this. The guy's fearless. Ah, it's on something soggy. I oh hate yeah, good choice on that guy. You know, they feel I'm terrified of them. Calico, calico. Is that some kind of Japanese curse word? It's a kind of fabric, you ignoramus. One nothing for the girls' side. Oh. <laughs> You know what? Maybe I am too competitive. I guess hearing the girls celebrate their victory and calling us losers won't be that bad. I am not a loser. I guess you're just not interested then. Why don't we just give up and tell them they're the best? No way we're doing that. Hmm? I think someone wants to win this. Let's crush them. Hmm. <gasps> ah! What is this horrible weird mess? I fixed up our room. Cute, huh? There's something smoking over there. It's incense. It keeps negative energies far away. Are you serious right now? Sure am. I can't stay in a room like this. That's too bad. Guess the room's all mine. You out of your mind? I'm just used to having a lot of space. <sighs> That's your side. You like it? Maybe you don't understand. If I don't have my space, I'm not calm. If I'm not calm, I don't sleep well. If I don't get my sleep, I get bags under my eyes. If I get bags, I get very nasty. <laughs> Those books. Mm -hmm. You moved my nail polish collection to make room for old dusty books? They're classic fashion industry books that have been out of circulation for years now. Yeah, I wonder why. <gasps> I hope you're not serious. Don't listen to her. That happens to be the most important collection in the world. Maybe in your world, but here, the most important collection to have would be shoes. Okay, maybe purses are too. Oh, like these sweet babies. Well, get used to it, because where I come from, 
Purses are just purses, and shoes are just shoes, and they all end up here in a box. But my shoes wouldn't fit in there. I've got 134 pairs. Well, it's time to say goodbye to them, then. Nobody puts Bianca into a corner. <laughs> okay, you're going to put everything back the way it was. Well, I really like it like this. But if you don't like it, you do it. Or maybe girls from your part of the world are above doing things like that. I mean, you could always just leave. I'll give you time to think about it. I'll see you later. Ooh, negative energy. Negativity disappear. She won't lift a finger to tidy up that room, so I think it's... Adios, Bianca. Oh my goodness. What's that? A mouse? Maybe it's a billy goat? Oh, an okapi! What's an okapi? Uh, it's kind of like a zebra. And a mouse. And a dog. I worked on a campaign to prevent their extinction. You are... Weird. I know. But so are you. Eh, I created a dark room in here to develop my pictures. I need to have my photos. Cool. Um, what's that one? That's me and my father. Gozy. I never knew my father. Hmm? Ah, uh, he preferred to jet off to another country and start a new life instead of staying with me and my mother. I'm sorry. I only have two things of my dad's. A t-shirt from the band he played in with my mom and a photo with his back turned. Lucky me, huh? I don't even know what he looks like. Why Over the Rainbow? It was the name of the band they played in. Oh, that's really cool. Huh. Yeah, they had to stand side by side for you to read the whole name. Which one do you have? Over Rain. Oh, I get it. So when you find a man with a shirt that says The Bow, that'll be your dad. Yeah. I don't believe it. How did you do all this by yourself? It was easy. A piece of cake, even for a girl from my part of the world. Hm. And how exactly did you do all this? H how did I do it? Yeah. Well, just like every other housewife does it. And that is? Well, I dusted, like this. <sighs> That's moving it around, not eliminating it. And then you spray a bit of this around. That's perfume. Whatever. <laughs> it removed all those nasty incense smells. I sprayed water on the floor and I dried it, but not the usual way, with a hair dryer. A hair dryer? Yes, a hair dryer. Then you use that machine that's noisy and picks things up off the floor. It's called a vacuum cleaner, if you want to get technical. And you vacuum before spraying the floor and blow drying it? There's no use arguing. As you can see by the results, the room is shining and clean, therefore it's mine. If you think I'm giving up, you're wrong. I worked for years in my Nana's garden. Do you know what that's like? That you like digging? that I'm not afraid of hard work. Well, I grew up wearing goldies. Do you know what that means? No. That I'm used to walking in incredibly high heels. I'm not afraid of hard work either. Hashtag this means war. Looks like the competition between these two teams is really starting to heat up. Each team has an envelope with a paper pattern inside. You will have just a few minutes to make your creation. A paper pattern? That's easy. Then do we sew a tag on that says made in Italy? Just enjoy the game or tomorrow you might regret it. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Teams, send one competitor forward, please. You can do yeah. this. You got this. Come on. Come on. Oh. Come on. Oh. 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 Do it. Get ready to lose. Since when did you become a seamstress? Mm -hmm. Play nicely together and be sportsmanlike. But let's see some bloodlust here! <laughs> Come on, Jacques! You can do it! One, two, three, four, five. Time is almost up! 2058, 2059. No, wait! I don't want to be a seamstress! 2071. I'm having fun over here! 2072 and... <laughs> It'll be perfect for the Okapi campaign! For what? Uh, 
Here, uh, look. What the heck is that? Look back. Wait, What's wait, your problem, wait, Scotland? Wait. I'm thinking collaboration during a competition isn't their strong suit. Really? Okay, that's enough. Go to your rooms, all of you. Just calm down, relax, and get ready for the next task. Maggie, 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 can you hear me? It's Mom, Maggie. Mom, you've got to speak louder. Are we supposed to be relaxing? I'm relaxed. Oh, bunny rabbit, I miss you so much. How is it going there? <laughs> oh, wait a sec. I've got a surprise for you. Okay. Can you turn down the volume? Does it bother you? No. There. Okay. Now, where is it? <laughs> oh, here it is. Guess what I did? I wrote you a little song, bunny rabbit. That's awesome. Can you sing it to me? friends. Yeah, I do. Bye, Maggie. Bye-bye, sweetie. Bye. What's that awful smell? It's my way of getting rid of your negative energy. <sighs> Not giving up. You surrender. Not giving up. You surrender. Did I surrender? Me too. But I'm not going to leave the academy. And I don't want to go back and live with my father after what he did to me. What did he do? He made me share a room with you. Right. That was really unfair of him. I just want to prove that I'm better than he thinks. I understand. <laughs> oh, brother. Maybe we really do have something in common. I hate saying this, but I'm sorry. I acted like such a stupid fool before. No need to be sorry. You were just acting like a normal person would. Let's prove to everyone how wrong they were about us. <laughs> no, let's stick to our own side of the room. <sighs> I knew that Frosty Ice Queen was still lurking around. The last game in your competition was created by Mr. Max. But you can just call me Uncle Max. That won't be happening, you barbarian. And please take that disgusting thing out of your mouth. What, this? You are so <laughs> rude! <laughs> As I was saying, the next game will be... Carry on! Oh, this should be good. All right, first up will be the boys' team. Jacques, you go first. Uh -huh. Come on, go, go, go. Come on, come on, Jacques. Get up and go. You got it. You scan me like on Candle Valley and you talk about me like I wouldn't even dare just let me be okay we're gonna lose or just deal with it cause every day's a battle when nobody wins and whatever you do I do the opposite but when you smile I see a white flag in your eyes hey why don't you take a walk Bravo! You're helping the enemy! I stumble and fall I run till I'm breathless Just to follow my dream <laughs> Very nicely done! A point for the champions! Yes. yes! And now for the ladies! Bianca? You're up. There's no way. I don't sing. If you won't sing, then I'll have no choice but to give the point to the champions. Come on, you can do it. Yeah. <laughs> no singing? Then I'll dance for you ladies! <laughs> <laughs>
lost because of Max's game, but at least we had fun. I still think we should have called ourselves all brawn and no brains. It would have made so much more sense, and it would have been a lot easier on Franz. <laughs> Just wanted to say I'm sorry. I'm not good at losing. Or winning, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Who cares about that competition anyway? It's a girl thing. We have more important battles to fight. Wanna play? You're the best roommate. <laughs> Maggie, where's the ice queen hiding out? She had something important to do, something that required a lot of effort. <laughs> you can never be seen by anybody, understand? I understand. If the handmaster sees Dolores, the niña is in mass trouble. I just love being me. Yeah. All right? <clears throat> I don't sing because Dad said it's for losers and it'll ruin your life. It was his dream once, and he gave up on it. I guess I will too. Over the rainbow. Now I'm in Italy, Dad. Your country. I wonder if I'll meet you here. You never know. Thanks, Dad, for giving me this t-shirt from the loser band you were in. It'll be a constant reminder for me not to sing. <gasps> okay, I guess I was wrong about you. Good job. You don't know anything about me. There's one thing I do know. You can be infuriating and adorable at the same time. Hashtag together forever or whatever. 